What's going on guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are playing Germany, this is part 2 and let's get straight into it. First thing we have noticed is we are actually at war with France, somehow I have no idea how and why. But we have to take care of that in one way or another. We have gained Luxembourg and Antwerp, so that those are our two main goals. Uh, let's look at diplomacy, what has happened here, the Soviets. I want to attack Poland as long as I take the three small countries next to me. Okay, 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 that is fine. That is completely fine. I don't know why he's at war with me. He has a disadvantage because there are, we ha I have forts here. Um, so I don't know if this is a good uh, situation for him. Although... I don't know why he's at war with me. Let's ask him, I guess. Uh, why are we at war? It could be a mistake. It could very well be. Italy wants to join. We accept them. Which is good. It's good to have them. And we, ha we have a larger military than... than uh, France, so we should be fine. All right, Yugoslavia is on our side. They are looking good. Uh, Poland, what do we do? Do we take more? We could take a lot more. How about we just take this? But I would like just the four provinces. I don't wanna overextend my borders to a point that is it is not the Germanic land, you know, which could be overextended even uh, come to this this being overextended. Well, a Krakow. Warsaw as well. Um, that is more than possible, my friend. But we do not need non Germanic land. Um, it is not in our interest. In our interest to own these lands. As we have stated, we would like the provinces of Danzig, Danzig, Poznan. Lodz and uh, what was it? Uh, and Torun and Torun. Uh, as a sign of gratitude, we would like to give you the other lands so our nations can be on a friendly level and hopefully seek eternal friendship all right uh we'll talk about that later uk is here i don't know we're not at war with them what happened here though we can probably see that trade offer province captured province captured no surprise attack i don't know man i do not know we have four tank divisions over here we will send that over here to secure. We have a bigger military than them. I, I, I still don't want the war, you know. I still don't want the war. Like, why would I want a war with them? I don't need their lands. Maybe Strasbourg, but that is still a claim that is claimed by both sides. And I am not sure about that. I very well am not. So, what we can, we will try to avoid a conflict with them. So, let's move on, uh, we look over here, 
We don't need as much. We built this, right? No, we did not. Only 30. That's surprising. Let's send this fleet over to here. We need to protect our coasts. Research. Let's go to research. Do we have anything? I don't think so. Yes. Well, no, we don't. Uh, we will probably send... We have a lot of... Okay. We can bomb them with this. We could probably send this to a better position over to Frankfurt over here. And they are attacking. They are attacking. <coughs> we'll just send these tanks over here and this stuff. So I think that should be enough. This isn't a border. So we'll send this as well. Send this and uh, these as well. <coughs> we'll not take this. Uh, kind of unmannerly um, how do I say this uh, action they will not take this kind of action seriously and we will not let them uh... man how do I word this I mean I'm famous famous for my English right I mean my English is actually very good Surprisingly, I, I, uh, my, my English is, is insanely good. Unlike, I mean, most. Come on, man, you serious? Okay, okay, you're getting it. You, you are getting attacked. I don't give a fuck. Get your ass off my fucking, <coughs> out of my fucking land, man. If we will, we will take anything. We will take Strasbourg, and that is it. My English is surprisingly good. Do you know why? Well. <laughs> I mean, I didn't know English at the start. Not at all. I, I uh, didn't know English very well. The way I learned it is was through uh, YouTube and I learned it very fucking well. I learned it very well. And I am forever thankful to this whole website and the, to the people who make content here. That may also be one reason why I am making content and I make videos over here. We have run, run, <coughs> we have ran out of manpower by now. Quite surprising. Uh, we will send a lot of stuff over to here. We will try to keep our cities, our land safe from the French, French uh, bitches. <laughs> but nah. no insult to the French nation in real life. Although France, not really. I mean, I like Germany more, to be honest. I like Germany more, but you know, France is cool. France is cool, yeah. Alright, we have our borders secured over here. This is mostly secured as well. We can send even this stuff over to here, for example, and a lot of our troops over to here without a single problem. Because Yugoslavia, Italy secured this, isn't gonna attack us. Yugoslavia may attack them. We have enough on Polish border to, you know, defend from the Soviets as well, in case they attack. So we should really be fine. <coughs> we have a naval bomber in case the UK attacks, so that is good as well. We also have somewhat of a navy, so that is fine. We don't have anything else to build up, but for now we'll just defend from here and then we'll see what happens. We may sign peace if we do. We'll maybe try to take Strasbourg and then we'll move to the Netherlands, Dan uh, Denmark, and further on Poland and Switzerland. So that is our goal. That's what we are looking to do right now. Hopefully we can repel the attacks from the French from the French bastard that is trying to destroy our wonderful nation. Don't forget this isn't Hitler is in charge, let's say. So yeah. Okay. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, this is gonna be the end of this video. Uh, it's been a pretty decent one. And uh, yeah. Thanks so much for watching. And goodbye.